solve these trigonometric inequalities, where, x is in the closed interval 0, 2 pi. The middle expression is the modulus of the difference of two square roots. Firstly, we simplify the middle expression. We let y equal root of, 1 plus sine of 2x, minus root of, 1 minus sine of 2x. Then, y squared equals, 1 plus sine of 2x, minus 2 times root of, 1 plus sine of 2x, times 1 minus sine of 2x, plus 1 minus sine of 2x. Sine of 2x, and negative sine of 2x cancel. 1 plus 1 equals 2. 1 plus sine of 2x, times 1 minus sine of 2x, is equal to, 1 minus sine squared of 2x. 1 minus sine squared of 2x, equals cosine squared of 2x. Square root of, cosine squared of 2x, is equal to, the modulus of cosine of 2x. So, we have, y squared equals, 2 minus 2 times the modulus of cosine of 2x. Then, the modulus of y, equals root 2 times root of, 1 minus the modulus of cosine of 2x. Now, the original inequalities become, 2 cosine of x, is less than or equal to, root 2, times root of, 1 minus the modulus of cosine of 2x, which is less than or equal to, root 2. Divide the inequalities by root 2, we have, root 2 cosine of x, is less than or equal to, root of, 1 minus the modulus of cosine of 2x, which is less than or equal to 1. Because the modulus of cosine of 2x, is greater than or equal to 0. So, root of, 1 minus the modulus of cosine of 2x, is less than or equal to 1, for all x in the closed interval 0, 2 pi. This implies that, the right inequality imposes no restriction. So, the only real constraint is, root 2 cosine of x, is less than or equal to, root of, 1 minus the modulus of cosine of 2x. Now, we divide the problem into two cases. Case 1, if cosine of x is less than or equal to 0, that is, if x is in the closed interval pi over 2, 3 pi over 2. Then, the inequality holds automatically. Case 2, if cosine of x is greater than 0, that is, if x is in the interval 0 inclusive, pi over 2, or x is in the interval 3 pi over 2, 2 pi inclusive. Given that, cosine of x is greater than 0, we can square both sides without reversing the inequality. So, the inequality becomes, 2 cosine squared of x, is less than or equal to, 1 minus the modulus of cosine of 2x. Rearrange the inequality, we have, the modulus of cosine of 2x, is less than or equal to, 1 minus 2 cosine squared of x. We know that, cosine of 2x is equal to, cosine squared of x, minus sine squared of x. Because sine squared of x, is equal to 1 minus cosine squared of x. So, which can be written as, 2 cosine squared of x, minus 1. Rearrange the equation, we have, 1 minus 2 cosine squared of x, equals negative cosine of 2x. So, the inequality now becomes, the modulus of cosine of 2x, is less than or equal to, negative cosine of 2x. This implies that, cosine of 2x, must be less than or equal to 0. We are given that, x is in the closed interval 0, 2 pi. So, 2x is in the closed interval pi over 2, 3 pi over 2, plus 2k pi. Where, k equals 0, or 1. When k is equal to 0, 2x is in the closed interval pi over 2, 3 pi over 2. When k is equal to 1, 2x is in the closed interval 5 pi over 2, 7 pi over 2. So, x is in the closed interval pi over 4, 3 pi over 4, or x is in the closed interval 5 pi over 4, 7 pi over 4. Note that, the inequality cosine of 2x is less than or equal to 0 holds, when x is in the closed interval pi over 4, 3 pi over 4. Separately, the condition cosine of x is greater than 0, means that, x is in the interval 0 inclusive, pi over 2, or x is in the interval 3 pi over 2, 
2 pi inclusive. The intersection of the closed interval pi over 4, 3 pi over 4, and the interval 0 inclusive, pi over 2, is the interval pi over 4 inclusive, pi over 2. The closed interval pi over 4, 3 pi over 4, and the interval 3 pi over 2, 2 pi inclusive, have no intersection. Similarly, the inequality cosine of 2x is less than or equal to 0 holds, when x is in the closed interval 5 pi over 4, 7 pi over 4. Separately, the condition cosine of x is greater than 0, means that x is in the interval 0 inclusive, pi over 2, or x is in the interval 3 pi over 2, 2 pi inclusive. The closed interval 5 pi over 4, 7 pi over 4, and the interval 0 inclusive, pi over 2 have no intersection. The intersection of the closed interval 5 pi over 4, 7 pi over 4, and the interval 3 pi over 2, 2 pi inclusive, is the interval 3 pi over 2, 7 pi over 4 inclusive. In summary, for cosine of x is greater than 0, we have, x is in the interval pi over 4 inclusive, pi over 2, or x is in the interval 3 pi over 2, 7 pi over 4 inclusive. For cosine of x is less than or equal to 0, we have, x is in the closed interval pi over 2, 3 pi over 2. Hence, overall, x is in the closed interval pi over 4, 7 pi over 4. That is the answer.